everyone, I hope you're all super well. Um, I'm trying to make the most of the last bit of daylight today and try and squeeze this fashion haul in for you all. So I'm really sorry if the lighting is a little bit dodgy. It's a mixture of H&M, pretty little thing, and also a couple of bits that I was sent from Chi Chi London before my trip to Paris. So yes, I'm gonna get straight on into it because I don't know if this is gonna be a long one or not. And yeah, this is what I have been wearing recently. Let's start with what I'm wearing right now. It is this black oversized hoodie from the men's section in H&M. So I usually tend to go to like Primark men's section when it comes to just like really basic, like solid colored black hoodies. And I was in H&M um, and saw this one in the men's section and it's absolutely perfect. Obviously it doesn't look like much on camera, but I'll add a few pictures in. Um, here of times that I've been wearing it and it's just the perfect piece to style and to have in my wardrobe just like the ultimate oversized hoodie it's just so nice I got this in a large I believe um but I will write on the screen if it's any different and yeah I definitely need to pick up some more colors in this because it is such good quality as well and yeah I've definitely been um, grabbing it pretty much most days so I need to get a few more in my collection next thing from H&M again I've had quite a lot of wear out of since I've had it and it is this really nice boxy, I'm just gonna have to hide myself, boxy like um, sweater vest. It's got like a really, really nice knit detail to it and a round neck. And I got this in a size, it says medium. I think it must be a medium if it says medium. Um, yeah, it's really nice and oversized and boxy. It's got like quite a low um, cut at the arm. Um, so you can wear like really nice um, bralettes under it or I could wear like a shirt under it or long sleeve t-shirts and things like that. You can style it so many different ways. Um, and yeah, I'm really excited to have this in my wardrobe, especially like going back into the office and things. You can definitely style these sweater vests in like a really nice, like smart, casual way. And the last thing I picked up from H&M, you might have spotted these if you follow me on Instagram, but they are like the most Marmite loafers ever. Um, they really remind me of the Prada, like super chunky ones. Um, Jordan literally was like, what are those? He absolutely hates them, but I love them. They're quite comfortable to be fair. They're quite solid at the back still, so I do need to break them in. But I did wear them for a couple of days in Paris and I've got like just a little mini insole in there just to try and help me out of it because I was in between sizes. So these are a four, but I did try on the three and a half and it was really, really small. Um, so I would recommend going up a size if you're shopping for these online and then just putting an insole in them because that's what I did. And yeah, I have just styled them so many different ways with like jeans or with nice dresses. I actually wore them with a dress that I'm gonna show you um, in a few minutes and yeah they're really really comfortable and I think I will have these in my collection for quite a few years to come. I've got a hiccup literally here. There we go. <laughs> the Chi Chi London really kindly sent me some pieces from their website. They literally arrived just in time for my Paris trip so I wore two of the pieces when I was there and I've been wearing the other one when I've been back which is this set. Um, yes it was a set. It's like this gorgeous black, just like crop top sports bra. I don't know if you can see, but it's got, there you go. It's got like this mesh detail at the back, really, really pretty back. I got this in a size small. And then the matching leggings are not inside out for once. Normally I'm showing things inside out, um, but they've got a really, really nice thick waistband. I've got a bit of fluff on them. Really nice thick waistband that just really cinches you in. They're such a nice material. Like they suck you in, but they're not like restrictive if that makes sense. And then on the bottom, they've got this really nice detail. Let me see if I put my hand in there, if you can see it better. It's like this on your leg. Really, really nice. I've worn these to the gym a couple of times and I absolutely love them. They're just super plain. Um, they've got like a little bit of, um, like rib detail on the back, I really don't think you can see that on camera, but they're so, so gorgeous on. Um, I need to get a picture wearing this set. So once I've got that, it will be on my Instagram, but I didn't even know that they did like athleisure and gym sets. So yeah, definitely worth checking their website out um, if you are in the need for a new set, just to give you that bit of motivation. I always feel like when I go to the gym or I go to a class um, or I want to go to a class, 
I feel like having new gym clothes like really, really motivates me and there's nothing worse than being in the gym and feeling like uncomfortable in what you're wearing. So yeah, having a nice cute gym set is definitely something that I do to stay motivated. The next thing that I got from Chi Chi London, again, I feel like I always pick things that are super hard to show on camera, but I do have a Instagram picture of me wearing this, so I will include it here. Um, but it's this gorgeous like wrap knit dress. It's cream and it's got this tie front there, long sleeve v-neck, so, so nice. I wore this um, on my first day in Paris with the chunky loafers and some socks and I just absolutely love that vibe with an oversized blazer and like a little handbag. I just felt like super cool, super comfortable as well. Last thing from Chi Chi London, I'm looking at it here and it's just not gonna do any justice showing it of me holding it up, but it's this gorgeous, gorgeous um, one shoulder jumpsuit. I wore this um, again in Paris, actually when I got engaged, um, little drop there of that, that happened. Um, but yeah, so I wore that on that night of our anniversary and it was the perfect jumpsuit. I wore it to dinner and it fitted absolutely perfectly. Obviously I'm like five foot nothing and I just had like a little heel on with them, or with it, and it was absolutely perfect. So yeah. Um, the perfect timing that jumpsuit arrived and yeah i will obviously have added the pictures for you guys to see it on um i definitely will be keeping this in my wardrobe for all of the christmas parties coming up and things like that it's just a classic black jumpsuit you can have in your wardrobe for years be really happy with those bits and definitely check out Chi Chi london if you haven't already finally moving on to pretty little thing i have tried to keep my online spending habits to a minimum recently but it's quite difficult when everywhere has such cute pieces in um i only got three things from pretty little thing over the past little while but i wanted to show you them anyway um i haven't got pictures in any of these yet so i'm going to try and do my best job at showing them here and describing them but we'll see how it goes um so this jumper is so cute i've got like a thing for cream knitted things this year I also bought another vintage jumper when I was away, um, but because it's not like a brand or anything, I thought there's no point showing it. Um, but it's this one shoulder knitted cream jumper with like a balloon sleeve. So, so nice. I got this in an extra small. It's just the perfect piece that if you're going out somewhere that's not super dressy, but you don't want to just wear like a jumper and jeans. I feel like the whole one shoulder thing just like really elevates your outfit. So yeah, I'm really excited to have that in my wardrobe and I definitely will get a lot of wear out of this. I kind of thought when I was buying that jumper, I was like, I need some like casual-ish trousers. And then I was like, everyone's wearing cargo pants. It's that whole like mean girls thing. And I was like, I need some cargo pants. Um, these were really affordable from what I remember and I got these in a UK four. They're really, really nice khaki, literally just like plain cargo pants with some um, pocket details on them. Again, the camera is doing them no justice. So I definitely will try and get some pictures on my Instagram of these for you or you'll see them in my vlogs. Um, but they're so, so comfortable. But again, I just know I'm gonna be able to wear these in so many different ways with like little corset tops and heels for nights out and like blazers and things. Pretty Little Thing had loads of different options, whether you wanted ones that were like cuffed at the bottom or different colors or different patterns. I just went with like the classic cargo style, but yeah, I absolutely love these. The final thing from Pretty Little Thing, I haven't actually worn yet. It arrived yesterday, I believe. And I am going to Manchester next weekend for a friend's birthday and wanted to treat myself to something to wear. Um, I'm trying not to do this as much, like as soon as I've got a night in plan, night out plan, sorry, um, to buy something new for it because I used to do that all the time and it was so bad and so unnecessary. But you know, just sometimes you wanna treat yourself. So this is what I got and I need to either get it tailored. I'm not probably gonna have time to do that. So I'm gonna need to do it myself. Lucky PU bandeau split hem jumpsuit. So nice. It's literally got this like um, corset, like what's it, boning detail, I think that's called. And it just goes in at the waist like that. And then it's just got this seam running all the way down it, down the legs until you get to like the split at the bottom. Again, this is doing it no justice on camera. So as soon as I've got a picture, I will pop that on my Instagram. I always leave my Instagram down below if you want to follow that because that's where you will see like most of these outfits on and things and like styled up um, so you can get a bit of a better idea. But yeah, this is so, so nice. It fits really lovely and it feels like 
it's not actually difficult to get on because the inside is kind of a bit softer. So it's not like the whole Ross from Friends situation with the leather trousers, like trying to get them on and off. I'm super excited to style that up. And yeah, I'm just gonna wear it with like some mini heels and a nice bag and some cute jewelry. So that is everything that I have been buying recently. I feel like that was a bit of a speedy haul, but I just really wanted to get through everything and show you without rambling on too much like I normally do. So yeah, thank you so, so much for watching and make sure you check out my Paris vlog as well if you haven't seen that already. Um, and as I said, I'm going to have lots more vlogs and home hauls coming soon because I have been going a bit excessive on buying candles and all of that stuff. So yeah, that is going to be the next video, but I hope you enjoyed this one and I will see you all very soon.